we see a sudden hearing loss commonly, and there's two, two causes. The first one is much less common, and that is um, vascular. Basically, it's, it's almost like a small stroke of the inner ear, and that can cause hearing loss. But by far the most common cause of hearing loss is, is a viral sudden hearing loss, meaning the virus gets into the inner ear, your body mounts an immune response against the virus, and then that immune response causes damage to the, in, to the inner ear, almost the way a forest would be damaged if two armies were warring against one another in the, in the forest. Um, it's, it's, um, it's fairly common now. We're seeing probably the incidences one in a thousand per year will event, will will present with some kind of sudden hearing loss. It's difficult to make an accurate diagnosis on the inner ear. It's not like other parts of your body where we can take a biopsy of your lung or of your liver or of your skin and look at it under a microscope. We can't really do that with the inner ear. But we do know that in people with a sudden sensory neural hearing loss, that's not from a vascular problem, there's no evidence of any stroke, that when we do studies on their inner ear, frequently post-mortem, um, that there's evidence of post-viral changes. So we attribute that to a virus, but it's generally not associated with any acute illness. So there, it's not as if they had a bad upper respiratory infection, they were coughing, sneezing, running a fever, and then they lost their hearing. Most of these people have no other symptoms other than Boy, I woke up one morning and I couldn't hear out of my right ear. I thought I had a cold. I put my phone up to my ear. I could barely hear it. Most of the time, they have no viral symptoms secondary to it. But postmortemly, they will have evidence of, of viral changes in their inner ear.